Sicilian defense, Grand Prix attack, 3, G64. NF3 BG75. BC4 E6. Intense that was a serious game. Black got the better of white in that game. Black played better than white in the opening. Black found some nice moves in the middle game. Black had the better end of a sloppy end game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The c pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the d4 square. The closed Sicilian tries for slower growth without a quick push to d4 and controls d5 with the knight. And c6 aids in maintaining control over the d4 and e5 squares. In the middle, f4 occupies a square, controls e5, and gets ready to advance the knight behind the f pawn. The dark squared bishop is getting ready to be fianchetto to g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. The e5 and d4 squares are under the control of nf3, which advances the knight toward the center. Fianchetto move bg7 places the bishop on the long diagonal. bc4 develops the bishop to an active square where it attacks the f7 pawn and controls the center. e6 controls the d5 square and opens up the e7 square. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is the final book action. This misses a chance to mold a bishop for advancement. It is incorrect. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. That's good. There was only one good move there. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. Backs off. It is quite good. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is quite good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This gains time by putting a queen in danger and getting it to flee. That's good. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. This misses an opportunity to develop a bishop off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This blows the chance to make a bishop threat. It is incorrect. This results in a pawn being lost. It is incorrect. This is how you take the pawn. It is ideal. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This secures a pawn. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. It is best. That knight will get material if captured. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This overlooks an opportunity to kick a bishop. This allows the opponent to develop a piece while also winning a tempo on a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is incorrect. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This can indicate that a pawn is being attacked. It is ideal. This prevents the adversary from making a pawn attack known. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is good. By posing a threat to a queen and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. It is ideal. This moves the queen to safety. It is excellent. This threatens to play checkmate. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is an inaccuracy. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. When the queen retreats, this attack wins a tempo. It is ideal. This attacks a knight and gains a tempo when the knight retreats. It is ideal. 
This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This overlooks a better way to defend a rook that was under attack. It is a mistake. This misses a chance to pose a pun winning threat. It is incorrect. This competes for the open file with the opposing rook. It is ideal. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. This adds pressure by pinning a bishop. This threatens to win material. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to create a passed pawn. This permits the opponent to take an open file with a rook. It is an inaccuracy. This accomplishes this by posing a threat to a rook and compelling it to flee. It is quite good. This reveals a rook attack. That's good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is quite good. Backs off. It is ideal. Now that the rook is on an open file, it is easier to control squares all over the board. It is ideal. A very strong play. It is excellent. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. Black still holds the upper hand, but they are no longer in a position to win. It is incorrect. This fails to take use of the chance to improve a bishop's square and broaden its range. It is incorrect. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. Recaptures. It is ideal. A solid choice. It is excellent. That's a decent move. That's good. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Very precise. It is best. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. Thus, the invading bishop is vanquished. It is ideal. Backs off. Black is ahead at this point in the end game. It is ideal. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. That's good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. That's fine. It is good. This gains a king. It is ideal. This protects the bishop who was attacked. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It's compelled. This defends the attacked pawn. This threatens to play checkmate. It is good. This prevents the adversary from playing checkmate. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is quite good. This protects a rook that was being attacked without any defense. It is ideal. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is quite good. This raises the possibility of an eventual checkmate. It is ideal. This allows a forced checkmate. It is a mistake. Intense that was a serious game. Black got the better of white in that game. Black played better than white in the opening. Black found some nice moves in the middle game. Black had the better end of a sloppy end game.